Let me see. Oh, here. because I was spelling it wrong. That's why. Um. I might be drippies. Yeah. No, either I was way, just. Either way. Gonna, yeah. Yeah. Either way, we're gonna be starting off here with the Palo Kage. I mean, they're making. They made it this far in the bracket, so they're definitely doing something right. But Apollo Kage is certainly a player to stop you from advancing if, uh, if you don't play this correctly. What if... What if this is... Um, do you see what the first four letters of Drippy's tag are? Uh-huh. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Nope. Is this a... Do is, this, is this Mexican Dr. PP? So anyway, uh, 120% to 10% here. Hey, we're gonna watch, I was serious uh, about that. We're gonna watch these two kind of go at it. <laughs> okay. So, um, from Snake's point of view, he's basically fighting a Metal Gear, right? Uh, yeah, kind of. I mean, that's kind of what Rob is in this game, the way he's built up, the way people like to talk about him. He, he almost yeah. is like his own Metal Gear. <laughs> yeah. Like, I, I feel like this was definitely like an event match in Brawl. Like, like oh, it's 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 just like Metal Gear Rex, haha, but it's like a big Rob. Might be. It um, might actually even be uh, in the story mode for this game. Yeah, that's true. Uh, I, in fact, I would be surprised if it wasn't. Mm. Oh, oh okay. no, just barely missing that. No, uh, this Metal Gear, not quite calibrated yet. Right. Um, but that up, that up throw sure is. Yeah, one for the Tombstone Pile Drive. We're going to close it out. And that's the thing. is actually, uh, Drippy's here went for like 120%, nearly unanswered. It was like 120 to 10%. And Apollo Kage put on basically 120 before losing a stock. So they actually made a hell of a comeback there. They weren't able to take the first stock. But they're still very much in contention. That forward air not going to do enough. But that neutral air, all of, like just every single hit, is going to be able to take out that stock. Evening things up here, 14% is the difference. Really not that bad, especially with Snake. Right. Now I do want to call. Now I do want to call back to one thing that happened the last time Apollo Kage was on stream, which was Apollo Kage lost a stock. Like it, that happened once the last time Apollo Kage was on stream. Uh, Apollo Kage proceeded to take the next six stocks from his opponent. Um, that Ooh. could happen again. Oh, jeez, man. Uh, yeah, Apollo Kage is definitely popping off here. We're, we're starting to see something. I don't think we're going to see, like, six straight stocks, right? But I do think we will end up Not with an Apollo 64. Kage. Surely. Like, yeah, I mean, surely, right? But I wouldn't be surprised if Apollo Kage still wins this set. But I probably spoke uh, too soon. As Drippy's is going to find that up air to take out that second stock. They're playing really well. And Drippy's is saying, I will take two stocks and don't call me Shirley. <laughs> okay. Well, gonna continue just doing a great job on this pressure. Okay, wow. tried to get the Z drop Nair. Wasn't really, in, I mean, they did get it, but the grenade actually wow. helped Apollo Kage get out of that disadvantage. This oh, is man. huge extra credit now. Oh, he's pincered, he's pincered, that's it. So as I was saying, Drip Beast is probably gonna win this set. <laughs> wow. Uh, Apollo Kage doing something that we have not seen him do on stream yet tonight, which is lose not one, not two, but three stocks. And a game. Um, wow, that was. Uh, I mean, okay, like that was even starting on the second stock, but then Drippy's just like completely shut down. Like I loved how Drippy's was using the gyro to shut down Snake's approaches with dash attack, um, and then it was just really, really uh, like um, fantastic gyro placement too. <laughs> um, yeah, the gyros definitely came in uh, to play a lot there. He actually uh, did a pretty fantastic job as well of, like, getting the Z-drop combos a little bit. I mean, that one of them was stopped by a grenade. But, yeah, overall, the pressure, the, the projectiles, everything. Everything was just really, really on point. Yeah, that was, like, the that was, like, that was just, like, a really fascinating game. Or, or not satisfying game. Because it feels like, like your own hit percentage was really high. And not just, like, the execution hit percentage. Where did Kage go? Uh, it looks like uh, we're or having no, where a did, uh, no, uh, test coming up. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. I mean, somewhat unsurprising. Uh, Missouri is not the closest place to Mexico. And, uh, you know, Mexico is a big place. We don't know where in Mexico uh, Drippies is. Um, but I like... I really hope that that lag test doesn't have an effect on this set because I really want to see more from Drippies here. Like that was, 
like I love seeing clinical rap play. Um, because mm -hmm. it, it, it wasn't just like the, the, the execution percentage of just like, yes, I'm hitting everything I'm going for, but also all of my decisions are correct. Right, like, right, that's right. when you feel really good. Mm -hmm. But we'll see what happens here. As mentioned before, there is going to be a uh, quick lag test here. Shout out, to, shout out to Shin. I've got a Shin controller here in my desk right now. Who's shouting out Shin? They play Mega Man on Wi-Fi. That's only a problem if you play Wi-Fi, buddy. Mm, I do. Because I can I know how to have fun. <laughs> that's true. I also, yeah, that's I play items free for alls on my stream. It's great. I've essentially um, stopped competing in tournaments though. Like that's oh, pretty same. much come to a complete halt. But I yeah. Wi-Fi Wi Fi is still fun when you're playing with friends, but that's about I'm as far as it goes. I'm coming up on two years clean in August. I'm I'm, nice. I'm really proud of myself. Very um, good. Yeah, uh, and you know what? Mega Man is a part of that story because I was at uh, I think it was like Battle Subway three, and they were gonna put me on stream against Mega Man. It's like I know, like I, it was like literally at that moment that I realized, like as a like personally as a player, I realized in that moment, like I actually care more about me and my opponent both having fun than I do about myself winning. Um, and so I know that if I get up on stage and I play this Mega Man player on stream, or like it was on stage, which is like, if I, if I play this Mega Man player, um, I know I'm not having to, I know I'm not going to have fun and chances are my opponent's not like, it's not going to be enjoyable. So, and that was the moment she's like, all right, you know what, take me on a bracket. I'm not about this anymore. Mm -hmm. and because I just want to enjoy this game and I'm enjoying what I'm seeing right now which is a, a, an arena with one person in it. <laughs> right. um. uh, yeah, I'm not sure what's happening uh, here exactly, but um, it is what it is. Uh, we'll definitely yeah. get something going very, very soon. Um, anyway, uh, how's chat doing? We got about 58 in he of you in here. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. The support means a lot. Uh, but what is happening? Who, who is Ted? <laughs> uh, that's Drippies. Oh, okay. I, was, I didn't read their name before. Yeah. Um, and I think that's that seems promising mm -hmm. if they're back in the arena. Um, I mean, it's definitely better than them not being back in the arena. Um... Okay, so this is the... All right, so I'm guessing this is the lag test here. Right. Um, so we can give a quick update, or we can give a quick... like we Let's take this time to establish the context for this match. This is winner's round two in top 64, and which means that the winner of this has one more set to play to make it into top eight winner's side. That set will be against Fuerza of Don, who um, has not dropped the, has not dropped the game in top 64, going 2-0 over Chokujo and 2-0 over Diamond Dupree. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, so, like, we're like top six, top 64 winners is crazy because like you very very quickly um, go from pools to like you win three sets and you're in top eight, which right. is, you know pretty crazy. Um, and Drippy's Drippy's overcoming Mega 2-0 in winner's round one of top 64. Um, and now up a game over Apollo Kage, who is, you know, you'd say probably one of the players ex who you could expect to make winner's side top eight at this tournament. I think seeded to do so. Mm -hmm. And also with a two over win over Blank as well. So d definitely somebody who's playing with a lot of fire right now. Right, right, right. Yeah, we'll definitely see how the bracket starts to shape up here a little bit. Uh, really just to see how this um, lag test goes. I mean, I, I would imagine that Apollo Kage probably called it because, I mean, it's kind of hard to call a lag test after you 2 0 somebody or 2 stock somebody. But, um, Maybe, we'll see, we'll but see, we'll see. I mean, you, like, you, you want to you play under the best conditions. Mm -hmm. um, oh, for sure, for sure. Yeah. But we'll see uh, how that plays out. We will be getting a couple uh, streams coming up, not streams, but sets coming up here. So if you are sitting there waiting and wondering what action we got coming up, we are going to be getting Elijah Min taking on Sassy Flygon. So if you like some of that uh, 
um, what is it, that uh, shop gameplay we had earlier. I mean, look no further. You'll be getting a little, a little bit more of that. Taking on Sassy Flygon, who we also had on stream earlier as well. They took on... Who would they take on? Uh, I forget their name. They were a hero player. Uh, 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 Dark Puma. Dark Puma, that is correct. Yes. I knew it was Dark something. Uh, but then right here, we also have 